Hi! So today, I'll show you how to make SDBS30 using the 5 to 9 detergents guide. This is a key ingredient for making dishwashing liquid. Before you begin, measure all ingredients and set them aside. To get exact measurements, visit the 5 to 9 projects website, open the calculator, select SDBS30, and enter the amount. In this case, 5 liters. Did you know? You can make and store SDBS30 for future batches. It lasts at least one year if kept in a sealed container in a cool, dry place away from sunlight and contaminants. Before using, stir well to ensure consistency. Let's get started. Take 10% of the total water. Use the water to dissolve the caustic soda in a separate container, stirring until fully dissolved. Be careful. Mixing caustic soda with water generates intense heat. Always wear protective gear and set aside to cool. In your main container, add the remaining water, then slowly add sulfonic acid Stir until everything is well mixed. Once dissolved, add urea and mix again. Gradually add 80% of the cooled caustic soda solution while stirring. Mix thoroughly, and after about 5 minutes, test for pH. If it's red, it means it's still on 1, and it's very low, so we need to add caustic soda solution. Don't add too much, as it could cause the pH to rise too high. You can see we added a bit too much here, and this might cause the pH to go very high. Be patient and add a little at a time until the pH is balanced. Mix thoroughly, and after about five minutes, test for pH. It's now green, which means the pH has risen to about 10. Here's a tip. If you don't have extra sulfonic acid, set aside a small amount of the main ingredients to help balance the pH later. Now, we need to add a small amount of sulfonic acid to lower the pH. Don't add too much. Just a little will do. Mix well for about five minutes. then test the pH again. If it reaches seven, congratulations! Your pH is now balanced, and you've successfully made your SDBS30. Now, transfer it to a container with a lid and leave it for at least six hours before using it. Alternatively, you can store it and use it later.